Well, I imagine most families up and down the UK have some kind of Christmas tradition, and the Lee family, well, they're no different, although theirs is a little bit more unique. It's winning the Welsh Grand National. And having this season taken over from Dad Richard, it's Kerry's turn to continue the legacy. Having won it with Bow Bay and since then with Mountainous as well, uh, Mountainous is really quite, you know, quite an achievement and um, it would really be great to run well in it. I think the fact that it's run at Chepstow and Chepstow has been one of our favourite courses for many, many years. It's a good, fair galloping track. You always get nice soft ground. They look after it really, really well. Um, love going to Chepstow. You always get a warm welcome too. Well, let's remind ourselves, shall we, of the Leaf family history with the Welsh National. The dream, I guess, began back in 2009 when Le Beau Bay was third in the race. That horse would then go and win two years later. And then Mountainous would get his handsome head in front in 2013. But let's close the door on the past for the time being and look to the immediate future, where they'll be relying again to try and win the race with the aforementioned Mountainous. Oh, well, he's a great flag bearer for the stable. Um, we're very, you know, very happy to have him on board. Um, he's absolutely no trouble to have here. He's a real kind of celebrity, isn't he? He does like require soft ground and he does need an extreme test of trip. Um, three, five is really now his minimum, I think. Uh, and all of his form, all of his wins have come on heavy or soft ground. Forget him on good ground and good to soft as you've seen him put earlier in the season. Well, Mountainous may very well be in the veteran stage of his career at 10 years old, but he certainly waited well enough to win the race and carries confident that the ability from two years ago still remains. Well, two years ago, I mean, he's down five pounds from when he won, won on the day. Um, I personally think he is as good. The London National was a very big ask on good to soft ground. It wasn't really soft enough um, and he will definitely be an improving horse on heavier ground. We've become familiar with this stable sending out the winner of the Welsh National, although it's still very much a team effort here at the Bell House. If there is to be another success story in the race, there will be at least one new name on the Roll of Honour.